Hi. So OTT is a simple but powerful effect. It is a multiband compressor and by compressing low, mid and high frequencies, its defect gives us a brighter and clearer tone. It can be used in a variety of different ways, on basses, musical instruments or drums. Although it doesn't sound great applied to the kick, it may give you a sound you're looking for. OTT can be found in Ableton under a multiband compressor effect, but I'll use my favorite free VST and also recommend if you're not an Ableton user. It is still a compressor, so it makes loud parts quieter. In this case we have pad playing with some spaces between chords. And the way I'm gonna make it sound incredibly good is by throwing some delay and reverb and then amplifying that with OTT. Listen how the sound changes. Now what we could do is to throw an LFO tool on it and has effect. So basically what a house effect does, it delays one of the stereo channels, so our brain thinks that this sound is really very wide but in reality there is only one sound panned to the left channel and another one to the right channel but one of these channels is delayed. OTT is also nice for making 808s and basically OTT is nice for sound design. Let's make two layers. One is gonna be a square wave, very distorted. Another one will be just a sub with soft distortion. Let's now add an OTT to the square wave and make space for our sub later. I just made some future bass chords, but they seem to sound a little dark. Let's throw an OTT and let's see what happens. Oh no, these are not hovering anymore. And they won't, cause we compressed them very hard and they are squashed. There are two ways to bring the dynamics back. You can reduce wetness or push the release knob, which is also called time, to the right. Now we got nicely compressed and not muddy anymore sound. If you add as little as 5% of the OTT on your mastering rack, it will give you a bit of clarity. Listen to it. If you want some free or premium samples, presets, project files, go ahead and visit my site oversample.as. See you in the next one.